First through of the boys next then as we go to the Craven Stakes. This is a one mile group three. It's a trial for next week's 2000 guineas and I never understood why the Phillies versions are furlong shorter and the Colts versions is over the exact same trip. Anyway, at the top, Milan's Richard for Dan Hughes, a winner last week, coming off the storm, or coming off the storm, or Joshua Sutherland, Edge of Silence, Jim Murray, that one won a winner last week as well. Egbert thrown straight into the deep end by Rod McClure. Hector for Craig Allen, Jiraga Box for D Slattery, also had its first run. Meridian Master, Vinnie Gerard, Pan Am Plain, Martellin, and Pazello de Zazon, Darren Thompson, Rembrandt, Paul Rhodes, Sabusa, Burma, David Robertson, Soldier Field, Badrake Hogan, and Warriors Shield, Jim Murray, they're all in and they're all out and racing a little bit slower to go was Rembrandt but they sort themselves out now through the first third or so and Jim Morris edge of silence is going to come through to take the lead is it nothing seems all that keen to take the race by the scruff of the neck and edge of silence has decided to eventually take up that role and he's in the lead right over on the far side is Jim Murray's other horse Warriors Shield that one's also going pretty well as they flash past the six furlong pole and so the first two furlongs didn't take too long to cover and it's edge of silence who's in the lead from warrior shield right over on the far side second then milan's which are in egbert sabusa burns after that and soldier field and then rembrandt and pad and plain well, last year's top two i was trying to run on as well but it's edge of silence who's the leader by a good three or four lengths then to Egbert and Milan's Richard, Abusa, Burma, Warrior Shield and Rembrandt and Hector is trying to get into it as well. They've got to get to this edge of silence who's coming down towards the three furlong point with a clear lead of a good two or three lengths. Now coming out of the pack is Egbert. Also Hector is coming through with a run. Pan and Plain wide on the track. Milan's Richard is also there. Rembrandt is trying to run on. They've still got to get to edge of silence who's too clear. Edge of silence in front. Milan's Richard is in second. Then comes Egbert and Rembrandt and Sabusa Burma, Hector Meridian Master, Soldier Field is next, Pan and Plain struggling to go to pace, in towards the back, Jimmy the books is a back marker, but they're inside the final furlong there, and it's still Edge of Darkness in the lead, Edge of Darkness holding on, here comes the fast finishing Egbert though, flying and also coming through really well is Meridian Master, and Meridian Master swoops to take it up from the fast finishing Hector Meridian Master takes the grave, and Hector is second, Pazuna de Zazon, right on really the third, and... Just didn't quite get home that Jim Murray horse and set it up for the closers. There's a steward's inquiry as well. Let's see what's going to happen, and nothing is what's going to happen. Meridian Master takes it for Vinnie Gerard. Hector for Craig Allen was second. Pazuana de Zazon. Darren Thompson third. Edge of Silence Jim Murray fourth. And Sabusa Burma for David Robertson fifth. And as far as next week's guineas is concerned, you wouldn't really necessarily think they're guaranteed to finish in the same order. I think quite a few in that race will fancy their chances of having another bash at it next week.